everybody, I'm Jess McDonnell and you're watching the show where we give you the lowdown on some of the biggest games we're expecting to hear more from at E3 this year. We've got a new game for each of the 10 days leading up to E3, so be sure to stay tuned. This is the part of the story that's really important. Now, this is the law of the jungle. It's not quite Halo, but it sure does share a whole lot of similarities. Bungie's Destiny is the studio's upcoming action roleplay first person shooter which is all set to sweep you off your feet with a brand new sci-fi setting. The Activision published game will be available across both Microsoft and Sony's current and upcoming consoles. The emphasis for Destiny is on creating dynamic gameplay experiences for players who will be able to explore the post-apocalyptic game world set 700 years in the future. Humans were spread out all across the solar system until an event called the Collapse destroyed these colonies and left humanity on the brink of extinction. Survivors of this event are now those living on Earth having been saved by the Traveler, a white spherical celestial body who originally facilitated humanity's migration into space. The player embodies the role of a guardian of the city and must destroy the threats to humanity's recolonization. These threats come in the form of hostile alien races called the Cabal and the Fallen, who have occupied mankind's former colonies since the collapse. The online-only game is described as a shared world shooter where players can choose between three races, humans, awoken, and exo. Humans are described as tough and uncomplicated. Bungie drew inspiration from athletes, action heroes, and soldiers. Awoken are exotic and mysterious, having been inspired by fictional depictions of supernatural beings like elves and vampires. Exo, described as sinister and powerful, their depiction has drawn from features of Halo's Master Chief and the Undead. Players will also be able to select from three classes, Hunters, Warlocks, and Titans. The Hunters are a bounty hunter-esque class who are reconnaissance-based, while Warlocks combine weapons with special powers that they've attained through the Traveler. Titans favor heavy weapons and are primarily a melee-based class as inspired by the typical idea of a future soldier. If you're up for some sci-fi action from a developer with a great lineage of creating engaging narrative-laced FPS gameplay, then Destiny will be a game to keep on your radar. Let us know in the comments what you think of Destiny and what games you're interested to hear from at E3 this year. In the meantime, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned to GameSpot for more hotly anticipated games in the lead up to E3.